Hey hello everyone my name is Ravindra and I welcome you to my YouTube channel In this video we will work with the Bing maps okay with the Bing maps we find out the our address by using latitude and longitude by using address we will get an points okay latitude and longitude as well means vice versa and also we by using bing maps okay we will find the distance between the two places okay so let's i go and jump to the make dot power automate okay so simply let's i click on the create let's use the instant cloud flow you can use uh, any trigger according to your need you can use power apps if you want to run the flow from power apps okay for now i just use the manually trigger flow okay click on the create let's provide the name bing maps okay let's click uh, let's uh, arrange this let's click on this plus icon click on add action and search here map it will load for few seconds and then just scroll it down and just click on the see more in the bing smash option so here we have the points okay get location by address get location by points okay so let's we click on that get location by points let's click one more time let's click on the add action let's search one more time map here. just click on here get location by address as well okay so let's go in the manual trigger in the manual trigger let's go and add the input let's add the text input let's give the name to this latitude just copying this and using it here let's add one more time now let's give the longit okay and let's uh, do the same name here longitude okay now it's done let's go and get location by point let's simply go in the dynamic content let's give here latitude and in the point longitude let's simply give the longitude okay there is a options are present okay so if you want to include the country code you can add and other things so okay. that is not meant get location by address let i put my home address here let's i put So here friends you can be see I simply putted my address here okay Sanjeevan College of Engineering Kopargao locality city state and the postal code country region okay so you can be put as well. so for now let's click on the connection okay so I already created a Bing Mac connection here okay for this as well let's try change the connection and showcase you how to create the connection as well. So simply just click on this plus icon search your bing map api key okay on your browser simply just go to your first page okay on the bing map here is a link is present bing map api okay so simply just go here from here you can be open that link okay go to bing map dev center we are going to this okay just simply sign on sign into this okay 
by using your credentials okay so i sign in successfully as well you can be see it is just loading okay and then here we have one more point just simply click on the account click on the my keys okay and in the key section simply just click here to create a new key okay just provide the name to your key okay and the type you can be see the basic and application type you can be select here according to your needs okay then you will get the key here okay in this format and expiration done date is also none okay so you can use this and this connector is also non premium connector okay if you see let's i search one more time map just see more okay so in the front of that it is not showing the okay i added wrong one so i delete this click here add map see more so you can be see here is no premium thing okay this is not a premium and here we have one more option get root so let's we use that as well okay we are came to this action so let's use get root action point 1 point 2 travel mode we are driving okay let's uh, use the point here and from here i provided the two addresses from this two one okay here avoid highways okay for now it is we keep it as none okay and let's click on the save now okay for the gate root we need to change the connection here okay it will ask api key only let's i showcase you how it work after saving this flow we change the connection for this last to action Let's I go change connection. Just click on here add connection. Give the connection name and add the API key that you get from here. Okay, simply. Not nothing. For now, I just changing my connection. Okay, let's cross verify it. Okay, connection is changed now. Let's click on the save one more time. Let's click on the test. manually trigger let's click on the test in the test action uh, we need to sign in allow location okay there is one pop up so i just click on the continue signing to bim map provide latitude longitude so let's i provide latitude longitude so in the power apps also let's i go to make dot power apps okay so here we have the function location okay from the location dot line longitude you can take longitude and from location dot latitude you can take the latitude and simply you can directly pass to the your flow okay from here by using v2 tree yeah so let's click on the run flow click on the done let's see our flow is run successfully or not but we are getting some error okay so our flow is run successfully let's see the output what we are getting here okay so in the output okay you can be see we get the address here correctly okay if you see format address ds7 when dindori pune okay so i am from pune that's why it is pune postal code highway address and all other things we are getting correctly in the body you can be see yeah in the get location by address uh, let's we go and see the output here okay so in the output you can be see we are getting the south west north east okay all latitude longitude okay and what do we need here address we want okay so here we will get the address as well 
okay here we get latitude longitude in this section okay so now uh, this is our last one root one so let's see the output what output we are getting in the root okay so it is distance in the kilometer also we will get okay dialog is second coordinates actual end start end So here you can be see we are getting all the things and also the corresponding address as well. 